April 14th and as you can see we did a lot of grocery shopping at Costco a little bit more than expected I think what would you say yep. what would you say our shopping trip was like it was easy we could have got way more stuff when you go to Costco it's expensive especially very expensive especially with her yes that's what I was about to say I could have went to hammer but I didn't go that ham I went just semi ham because um, I'm just trying to be good and save money but right now when we get home I'll do a like I'll do a grocery um, haul is it a grocery haul to show you guys what we got Try to guess. Okay, okay, okay. I won't tell you right now, but we got 33 we got, items. Yeah, I was about to say we got 33 items. Um, if you guys shop at Costco and you guys look at the items you buy <laughs> and you have a number in mind, then comment that. And then when we are unpacking everything, you guys can comment another number because why not? We have the baby back. Oh, yeah, Alan cleaned the car, so like the mirror is messed up, but you can kind of see everything right there. No face for me. But right now we're like probably three minutes away from the house, so then we'll show you guys what we got and then we'll see um, who's closest to um, guessing how much it is for everything that we got, that we bought. I thought I didn't even think it would be as much. No, and we got chicken bakes too. Oh yeah. Chicken bakes are fire. Oh yeah, that's everything. We got some almonds, some dank chocolate some, covered almonds. Yeah, some chocolate covered almonds. That I opened in the store. Also, I forgot. I think this video probably will go up before my hair cutting video, but I cut my own hair. My bangs, anyway. And Alan didn't know what I was doing. I did it after the shower, so he was just chillaxing, and I told him to close his eyes, and bam. What did you think about my hair, sir? Alan, what did you think when you saw my hair as a bang? Stop. Ah, okay, we'll see you back. I mean, later. Okay guys, oh my gosh, it's windy outside, don't judge my hair. The baby just woke up, say hi papa. Say hi. He's usually really happy when he wakes up, so I don't know why he's kind of grumpy right now. Probably got him at a wrong time. Okay, so this is all the stuff we got. So uh, everything right there, everything right there, over there, right here, all of that. It was a little bit more than we expected, honestly. We didn't think it was gonna be this much, but we'll start to show you guys. Let's put poop. This right here, which is expensive. Salmon, this thing was 30 bucks. It's fucking worth it though, because it's fresh. And this one was 20 bucks. 50 bucks just on salmon. Okay, so everything we got, 33 items. It came out to, um, fuck them, Luca. I'm gonna try the food. What do you think, Luca? How much was it that much? Little cheese things. Put some of that to put me on. Drum roll, please. Yeah, drum roll. That's who was right. Or if anybody commented, you know, you guys didn't, whatever. What is it? It's pretty kind of blurry. 467, 467. That's how much 33 items at Costco were. And let us show you those 33 items that we purchased. So I have my camera or the phone propped up on a pack of 12, I mean a 28 pack of 12 ounce Gatorade bottles and the milk chocolate almonds, so the almond covered in chocolate. And then we also got, what are these puppy? These are eight pack of kitchen towels. We got like this color tone just because our kitchen, we, we do use them a lot and our kitchen colors are like, as you can see, like cabinets are brown and white and the granite on here is brown, black and white. So I thought this would be a good combination. We got these Slim Jims. Yeah, Alan put me on these recently. He's been getting them from like gas stations and stuff. Oh, sorry baby. And they've been pretty good. <laughs> Look at them. Are you seeing yourself? And then we got, oh my gosh, we love the artichoke dip that they had at Applebee's, but they don't sell it there anymore. So we got the artichoke, jalapeno, and Parmesan cheese. This little tub, this tub right here. Yeah, it looks good. You wanna try it? Okay, let's try it. 
I'm just kidding. Okay. And then we got these pita chips to eat with that artichoke dip. If you guys haven't tried these pita chips, get yourself some pita chips. They're, they're amazing. And then I also got this dark chocolate nugget coconut and super seeds. It looked really good. Oh, it says back here, it says organic super seeds. It has sunflower seeds, chia seeds, pumpkin seeds, organic coconut, and dark chocolate. Anything else? Poppy seed muffins and um, which ones were these? these were Those are freaking apple, apple crumble muffins. Mm -hmm. So they're buy one, get one free. And then I got a pack of grape tomatoes just because this is an easy snack to munch on. You just grab yourself a handful of tomatoes. Um, if you don't like tomatoes, you know, too bad. And then I, oh, I already opened this. Um, I got some organic salami. And along with these um, Baby Bell cheeses, these are really good too as like a quick snack. Same with the salami, so those two, I got them together. I um, got some um, what are these? asparagus, a pack of asparagus. We got some um, bananas. Oh my gosh, and this. I'm so excited to make this or try this. This is organic spinach and cheese ravioli. Tell me that it's gonna look fire, because it looks fire. Ellen got a big, big ass bag of broccoli. Nico wants everything. You want to hug it or what? Give it a besito. Besito. We have some buns. Oh my gosh, I had a brain fart. What are these? Oh, peppers. I got a pack of peppers. So also a quick snack. I just thought all these to be quick snacks for us to eat. And then I got some cookies. Pumpkin seed and flax granola. I saw a lot of people put this in their oatmeal and it helps with um, milk production. Lately, my, well, my breast milk, so TMI. No. My breast milk has been on the low side. It's like not too low for him, but I want him to be making more and I read that that helps. So that's what we got. You know. Okay, and then we also got some Dove bars, 16 bars of Dove. We got a uh, mat. We got this mat right here to put in front of um, when we wash the dishes. We got some baby wipes. We got some baby wipes and some diapers. Alan kind of ripped the box of the diapers, closing the door um, of the trunk. I also got these mini melons. <laughs> Freaking out of being little. And then we got a bag of little potatoes. Easier to cut and cook when you're cooking them. Yeah. Turn them yeah. You're still recording? Yeah. So Alan got these Puma shorts. I think these are pretty good price. How much were these? Kind of like 11 bucks. Yeah. They're a pretty good price. Oh my goodness. This is probably one of my favorite things to do is buy baby clothes. The favorite. Oh, just look at this. Look at that. This is, this. these are like packs. So we each have like two or three packs. So that's one. Since it's getting a little warmer now, I got them. Um, I wanted to find some of these and I did find them. So they're like, oh my goodness. Look at these shorts. Look at them. They have little pockets. I told Alan I'm gonna change into that right now. <laughs> that probably won't. And then I did get like a bigger sizes just because he's growing so fast and he's already wearing six to nine months and he's only four months. So I also got these little onesies and these are nine months. Um, the size on it is nine months. And there's that other one in the back. And then we got this set. This is one of my favorites too. I mean, look at that. It looks like little overalls, but it's fun. And then this one too, adorable. And we have this shirt and it comes with just like little joggers. And then on the other side, it comes with more of a fancy, like this shirt here has a collar and then it comes with pants. And look how he's fighting. He's eating my shoulder. He's literally eating my shoulder. I think that needs to be warm. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. And then this is a last little outfit. It's a Mickey Mouse. It's so cute. So this is like a little jacket. And then 
This, look at this shirt. Did you see the shirt? Mm -hmm. It's a little Mickey Mouse that says, friends are awesome. You like Mickey Mouse? He looks at everything. And then the second one is a striped shirt with Mickey Mouse on it. And then the pants it comes with are like sweatpants sort of too. So yeah, guys, that was our Costco haul. Are these sodas away? Yes. We don't drink soda. We don't drink soda. Um, people we can order drink sodas so we can eat with whatever we're making that day. But they've been there for like a couple days and we haven't even touched them. Okay. So that is everything for now. I'm not sure if we're going to vlog um, later. Maybe we'll vlog our making salmon and stuff. Right? You want to do that? Tomorrow. I'm going to get a full. Maybe later we get hungry, if I get hungry. Oh, okay. Okay, puppy. Look at yourself. Look at yourself, say bye. Say, oh yeah, he said bye. He, I feel like he waves now. I might just be crazy, but I feel like he does. I mean, he gives us his hands already when he wants us to pick them up, huh? Mm -hmm. So, he probably does wave. I'm probably not going crazy. Maybe I'm not a crazy mom, huh? Okay, tell him bye, guys. We'll see you later. Yeah, okay. bye. Oh, he's hungry. Guys, oh my God, look at his little fit. What are you excited for? Say, I'm about to be, well, not about to be, but I'm almost five months. And I wanna walk. I wanna walk. Okay guys, see you later. Like, comment, and subscribe. Peace. To our beautiful little family here. Hello guys, and welcome back. It has been a long time later. It is already 8.43. And um, we stopped by. Oh yeah, Alan's still eating. We stopped by my dad's because um, I received this package that I ordered online. I'll link the lady's um, at on Instagram because that's where I saw her down below. So if you guys are breastfeeding moms and you want your my camera keeps and you want your milk supply to increase, I read really good reviews. Um, this is what it looks like. I'm so excited. I'm gonna make some right now. So that's why I picked up the camera. It's oatmeal confetti with chocolate chips, white chocolate chips that it comes with. And it's pretty cool. It tells you like all the ingredients back here. Alan is warming up artichoke chips. That's what he's doing. Okay, so yes, let's see. Directions preheat oven to 325. So that is what I am going to do. Here we go. Okay, so it's gonna be 1 fourth cup of water as well. Oh, I wonder how much is this? Okay, preheat oven, bake for 1350. Okay. Melt one and a half cup of butter. Come try this. Okay. Then we will need 3 fourths cup of butter. That's hella butter. I have my three fourths cup here. So I'm just gonna have How much do you need? Three fourths. This whole thing. So I'm literally just gonna melt. It's probably not exactly three fourths of a cup, but I'm gonna melt this. Will you take an outfit? Mm -hmm. Is it today or tomorrow? Okay. I'm gonna grab a bowl. I'm gonna put it in a bowl. My bangs look really flat because I'm not, they're not used to doing bangs. You guys can't see what I'm doing? Should I just say F it? Did you not walk on the bottom one? My butter that I'm gonna warm up and it looks like ice cream.
My baby's right here. Say hi. So while that is uh, melting, I'll talk to you guys about our apartment. So we have a lot of decorating to do, but I'm just not sure what we should put around the house. Cause I know I want a mirror, I think on that wall or this wall here, but I just don't know. They're so big. They're such big walls. I don't know what to put there. Huh? What do you think? Awesome. So our butter is finished. Okay. So it's like, oh shit. So it cost this, that's to make this whole thing. Yeah. I thought the directions were gonna be portioned by like um, a certain amount of cookies at a time, but it's for this whole bag, and this is quite a lot of batter. But I um, read on her Instagram post that she had um, posted that you can save it for later, so you can make this whole thing and save like the batter in the freezer, and it's good for a certain amount of time. I don't know. But I'm gonna grab a bigger bowl because I didn't know it was for the whole thing. Okay, so I have this big bowl right here. So you're gonna pour this whole thing, so add entire dry mix in a bowl, mix in melted butter, and two tablespoons of vanilla extract, which I don't have, and then um, one fourth uh, cup of water, and add two eggs with a handheld mixer until well mixed, pour on toppings. Well, I only have a whisk. I don't have like the automatic ones, so this is probably gonna take me a while to mix it all together, or not, it's probably, it's probably easy. But this looks so good. Let's see if you guys can see. There's oatmeal, there's confetti, and cake mix in there. So we're gonna pour that in there. Okay, so we have our batter mixed in here. Put in here. Aw, <clears throat> you asked him for some? Aw, well, Ellen got some vanilla extract for me. How cute. Thank you, baby. That's so cute. Oh, I love you. Okay, so we're gonna do add two tablespoons of vanilla extract. It's probably gonna be something. Oh, God, it's here. tablespoon measure thing here. I'm um, gonna read this again, I forgot. <laughs> okay, so put the entire mix in a bowl, melted butter, two teaspoons of vanilla extract. Okay, so you can. So we have our vanilla extract here and we're gonna do two tablespoons of vanilla extract. So there's one. Oh yeah, I'll show you guys pouring it in here. And there's two. Two tablespoons of vanilla extract, fourth cup of water. Oh, I have my little measure thing here, so I'm gonna put one fourth cup of water. Fourth cup of water. And then you're gonna add the butter and the two eggs. So now we're gonna add two eggs. I don't know if this is like a good video on how to make this, so. Whatever's. Okay, so I think I'm gonna need to mix. Okay, wait, two eggs and help mix your mixer until well mixed, pouring top toppings, which are these, these are my toppings. Place in the refrigerator for at least 24 hours before baking. Sure. That's that. Oh, okay, so it's good in the freezer for six to nine months. Six to nine months? Yeah, in the freezer. The batch. Yeah. Well, sad news. I should have read the instructions before even starting this. But it says that you're supposed to leave it in the fridge for 24 hours before baking. This is a consist consistency. I mean, normal batter. It really looks like normal batter. Looks pretty good though. And then, oh, Sorry. 
It says to um, fold with the spatula these in. So you're not gonna mix these, you're just gonna fold them in. I'm gonna pour them in there. And then... Then you're gonna what? I'll just do that. You're gonna fold them. So with one of these, it's pretty good. I'm gonna just fold them like this. Well, at least I like, tried to make it today because then I wouldn't have realized that you had to do it 24 hours, you know, when I wanted to make it another day. He wants a Gatorade. <laughs> okay. So I folded it all together. So that's how it looks. Now we're just gonna, I guess, store it in the fridge until tomorrow. And I'll make it. I probably won't honestly wait the 24 hours just because I'm really impatient. I already want to try these. I'm gonna make her. Huh? I'm gonna it tomorrow night. Uh, so I probably will bake these tomorrow after work. I get off at five. You wanna try it? No. It's pretty long. Don't come at me. Um, because I'm eating the batter. It's good. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and cover this with the lid and then I'm gonna put it, place it in the fridge. So I guess there will be a part two to this video because I obviously have to wait 24 hours to bake this. But yeah guys, again, like I said, I'll link them in the, in the description down below. They were pretty inexpensive. I think it was $25 for this bag. So excited it's made in hawaii so that's pretty cool and it came to me probably in a week it probably took a week not even maybe a week i had to check i don't remember but yeah but yeah but yeah but yeah okay guys i'll probably see you tomorrow we did excuse me excuse me um we were wanting to cook but we ate too many snacks throughout the day so we're not that hungry anymore so Maybe, since we're going to bake tomorrow, we'll make the salmon tomorrow. You want to do that? Mm -hmm. So that'll be a part of the vlog anyway tomorrow. I think it's like, eight, it's 9.02. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> it's 9.02. We probably, I think I'm going to edit some videos right now. Um, and then we'll probably go to sleep. Because I work at 9. Um, Ellen doesn't work, so he stays here with the baby. So that's pretty cool. But yeah, guys. So we'll see you tomorrow. Okay. I think Luca wants to say bye too. No, he's really trying to get. Are you trying to get a Gatorade? Hey, say bye. Tell him bye. With your toes. Look at his toes. Okay. All right. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. The one we make. Oh my God. I didn't even like the dip. I didn't really need a lot of it. But I did though. Okay. Anyways. So we'll see you guys tomorrow and hopefully these cookies work for me. Hopefully they work for you if you purchase them. Okay, see you later. Welcome back guys. Today is the second day of my vlog. And you didn't bring me one? Today's the second day and I'm here reviewing these cookies that we made. This is how they look. They're really fluffy. Like they're, they're, they look so airy. They're really good. They're not like a cookie consistency. They're more of like a muffin consistency, like a soft, super soft, fluffy. I don't even know how to explain it. What do you think? Okay, we're gonna get um, Ellen's. Here, try this. Sorry guys, in the background, he's watching Trolls. It's 
it's pretty good. It's like really light, huh? Mm -hmm. I don't know if he's able to eat this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I feel my boob leaking. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, this cookie, I give um, like taste wise and product wise. Taste wise and product wise, and packaging. I'm gonna rate the packaging too because you know it's a lot for people. Honestly, I'd give it like an eight out of ten. He's like pushing his head super hard against mine. Do you want to see yourself for what? Say hi, guys. Mm -hmm. Good job. But anyways. Hopefully this concludes this video. So we'll see you guys in our next video. Um, I think I'm gonna record, um, I mean record. I think I'm gonna edit the video where I cut my hair. I don't even know what to do with it. Or if I did it right, because it's kind of looking wonky now. So it's kind of annoying, but. Quarantine life. Anyways, we'll see you guys in our next time. Say bye.